Welcome to Up For Story Time. Are you ready to spare our time with Once Upon a Time? Today it's me, the teacher Barbara Castillo, and featuring the story The Three Little Pigs. Hope you like it. The Three Little Pigs. There was once a mother pig who had three baby pigs. They grew up and got bigger until the mother pig had to say, You need to go and build houses for yourself. But be careful, there's a wolf out there, and you won't want to him to catch you. The little pig set up, telling the mother, We will be careful. While they were walking, they came upon a man who was carrying some straw. May I please have some straw? Asked the first little pig. I want to build myself a house. Of course, said the man. And he gave the pig the straw. The first little pig took it and made himself a nice house. The other two pigs kept walking down the road. They came across a man who was carrying some sticks. Could I please have some sticks? Asked the second little pig. I want to build a house. The man said, sure. And he gave the little pig some of his sticks. The second little pig went on and built himself a house. It was stronger than the house of straw. And the second little pig was excited. The third little pig kept walking all by himself. It took a while but he met a man carrying some bricks. Please, could I have some bricks? Asked the third little pig. I want to build a strong house. Yes, said the man. The little pig built his bricks house, happy that it was so strong even if it took a lot longer to build. The next day, the wolf came down the road. He saw the half of straw that the first little pig built and went right up and knocked on the door. He said, Little pig, little pig, let me come in. No, said the pig. No, by the hair on my shiny chin chin. Then I huff and I puff and I blow your house in, said the wolf. And he huffed. And he puffed, and he blew the straw house right over. The pig had to run as fast as his leg would carry him to the second little pig stick house. The next day, the wolf walked further down the road. He came upon the stick house. He knocked on the door and said, Little pig, little pig, let me come in. No said the second little pig. No by the hair on my shiny chin chin. Then I huff and I puff and I blow your house in, said the wolf. And he puffed and he huffed and he blew the stick house over. The two little pigs had to run as fast as their legs would carry them to the third little pig's brick home. The next day, the big bad wolf walked even further down the road. He saw the third little pig's strong brick house. And he walked up to the door and said, Little pig, little pig, let me come in. No, said the third little pig. No, by the hair on my chinny chin chin, said the pig. Then I huff and I puff and I blow your house in. And he huff, and he puff, and he huff, and he puff. 
but he couldn't blow their house down. So the big bad wolves started climbing up the side of the house. Little pig, little pig, I'm coming in. He growled. The pigs were terrified. What were they going to do? The third little pig did the first thing he could think of. He lit a fire in his fireplace and pushed his biggest pot over it. Down, down, down. The chimney the wolf climbed until... The big bad wolf scalped his rear on the hot pot and scrambled back up the chimney down the street and never bothered the three little pigs again. Thanks for watch! Lot of kisses, good night! See you real soon in the up for story time!